I'm here with Leon Blanche, betting news spokesperson for Boyle Sports. Leon, Champions League, it's the knockout stages now. Chelsea taking on Juventus. It's going to be tough, but it's an away game for Juventus. So how do you think it's going to fare out? Yeah, it certainly is going to be a close game. Um, there's a lot at stake here in the Champions League, Nicola. We're down to the last 16 and no team wants to be out of it before the second leg comes along. However, Chelsea have got off to a great start under Gus Hiddink. Uh, they beat Aston Villa 1-0 yeah. away from home, which was a massive, massive win. It's given the whole club, great turnaround I'm sure, a lot of confidence. They're the 6-5 on favourites to win at Stamford Bridge. Um, you can back Juventus at 7-2. I wouldn't be going for Juventus at 7-2, to to be honest. Even though Claudio Ranieri is coming back to Stamford Bridge, the tinker man, as they used to call him when he managed Chelsea... But I can see Chelsea grinding out a victory here. The Italians will try and frustrate Chelsea. There's mm -hmm. no doubt about that. They have to because that's how the Italians play. But I just feel with Drogba and Anelka starting to get to know each other a little bit more. I just have to go with the home win here. And I can see Chelsea not scoring a lot of goals because they won't want to concede. It's imperative that the home side keeps a clean sheet if you want to go further in this competition. I fancy Chelsea to win, and I fancy a 1-0 scoreline, maybe a 2-0 scoreline. There won't be a lot of goals in this game, because it will be very tight. But as I said, Chelsea for me, just to edge out Juventus. And then also another big game, Liverpool taking on Real Madrid. Do you think Liverpool are going to improve now with Gerrard's back? Yeah, I mean, there's no doubt, Nicola, that he's a big, big player for Liverpool. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of pundits out there reckon that one player cannot make a team. But I disagree with them. I really feel when Gerrard plays, Liverpool play. However, Benitez's record in the Champions League has been nothing short of remarkable since he's been at Anfield. He's reached two finals and three semi-finals, which is unbelievable. However, as well, Real Madrid are starting to come back to a bit of form, especially at the Bernabeu. They won 6-1 last weekend. They're closing the gap on leaders Barcelona. They're 11-10 to, to beat Liverpool. Liverpool are 13 to 5 and the draw is 11 to 5. How's it going to go? Yeah, I mean I think there's going to be goals because I think the Madrid back four is aging. They are good players but they've no pace. I think if Liverpool can get in behind the Madrid back four, i.e. Gerard linking up at Torres, what a night it is for Fernando Torres too going back to Madrid to play against his arch rivals as a young lad growing up. He played for Atletico Madrid. I think Torres will score at the Bernabeu. But I also think Real Madrid might score. And I was going to go for a Liverpool away win. But now I'm not. I'm going to go for a draw. A score draw. 11-5 to 5 for me is the value bet.